Today we're doing another run through of the first melody in first position by Charlotte Berio. Um Most important thing is that you know when and where to prepare what. The reason I did all the videos before this one was to prepare you and explain how you could be ready for the next note. Yeah, sometimes, for example, the first bar we have, we can build simply by placing A, by building towards that C, and then place the third finger on the D string. This way, our first three notes are already on the violin. Yeah. Later on, you have the fifths. Remember where they are. Place the finger on two strings at the same time. The diminished fifths, be aware of that. The seventh from G to low first finger on the E string. That F, yeah? You have time to be there long before you need to play that note. That is what practice is for. So you know where to be, to prepare for what comes next. Yeah, sometimes you can't prepare, but this exercise gives you quite a lot of time. We've done it really, really slowly. And now we're at half tempo at 50. We have to go to 96, based on what Charlotte de Berio asked. So there's still a long way to go. So look for where you can prepare things. The more you are prepared, the easier playing faster will be. Anyway, we're at 50. Uh, first note is G, but I'm going to prepare it. So A, B, C, and the third finger on the D string. And now I'm ready for the first three notes. One, two, three, four.
there you go. I try to remind you of most of the places that you can prepare things. Uh, if you missed a few of those, take notes, practice it, and then um, try it again. And I'll be speaking, so I'll see you next.